So I haven't shaved uh, mine for about five years now. And, I mean, first of all, I should say that I absolutely think that it, you should do whatever makes you feel happy and whatever makes you feel great. I mean, I think that probably, hopefully, that's obvious. But actually, I think there is a little bit something else going on, which is if we live in a society, and we almost do, where every single adult woman removes every last hair the moment on it appears, like, like, you know, like sort of military operation, do we end up creating a society where, you know, female body hair is considered disgusting and revolting? And then what? What happens when a, a young woman turns 12 or 13, starts to grow a few hairs, and her immediate reaction is, this is gross, this is vile, this is horrible. Uh, I don't want young women to feel that way, that their natural body has something wrong with them. So in order to not have that, some of us have to take a stand and grow ours and be so, like, it's good, it's fine. Can I ask Kate, cool. if it's not too personal, do you do under up, do you shave your legs? Uh, I don't shave my legs. I don't have naturally very hairy legs, yeah. so it doesn't notice that much, but my armpits... Um, do you mind if we had a look? Would you like a little look? Oh, look this is <laughs> brace, five. brace. Sorry, Lizzie. Sorry, <laughs> I'm going to look. Is this five yes, weeks? This is five years. Five, five years. years. Sorry. Five years, yeah. Here, so here we go. There's the. Yeah. There, there's the that's that, definitely not trimmed or it's no. not tidy. manicured. Um, it's not so you manicured. Don't trim it or anything. I don't do anything. Okay. I mean, so Lizzie, I pop a bit of deodorant on. Can I show on. you mine? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so looking at Kate, no, what um, does that make you feel? If Kate lifts her arm, I'm up, sorry. It it's that? really. <laughs> I'm sorry. It makes me feel quite queasy and ill. I. I. Um. I just feel it's well. I do think it's unattractive. Mm -hmm. uh, I think most men and women don't like underwear, mm -hmm. arm hair. I really do. Um, I, there's just something that it's like Flintstone ages. We're, we've come a long way since then. But and why I just is it think it's different for man, if a man lifted, if Eamon lifted yeah, his armpits up, you wouldn't go, ugh, ugh. I, I just think, look, she I'm sure. <laughs> I don't know what's really, under if there. If you came down the stairs in a beautiful dress and you had a big bush, out of your armpit, Eamon would say, darling, beautiful dress, but what would you can say? you have a little trim under there? Probably would, actually. Um, first yeah. of all, I believe anybody should be able to do whatever yes. they want, like yes. Kate, right? Yeah. Secondly, I don't like hair on men. So this trend at the minute where they all look like Beverly Hillbillies or something from the outback, what's that called? Hipster. What's the, the, hip, hipster. Well, it's nothing hip about it. I, I look at that and I go, Ooh. So I don't like I don't like that whole look. So in fairness, I wouldn't be overly attracted to hair in general unless it's falling out of my head, and which then. But so isn't that, that interesting in a way? That, so men but isn't it interesting day. in a way that we immediately start going, "What do women do with their bodies?" Well, how you know would men be attracted to that? Well, I mean, hold on a minute. It's interesting because I do sometimes get that reaction of like, "Oh, this is gross," and quite often it's from men. And and let's be frank, they're not necessarily gorgeous honed yeah. Adonises <laughs> themselves, and they're like, "I find." that unattractive and I'm like well let, let me let me respond and tell me tell you what I find unattractive about you yeah, but the whole thing not interested thanks no but I um, find hair know. unattractive on men I mean ever mm. since I was young you, you, I could hear women saying a man with a hairy back yeah. Ooh. <laughs> you know <laughs> uh, but some women will say a man with a hairy back wonderful marvelous yeah, I must admit, personally I, I, what, I think I think hair looks great on guys and, and mm. I, I don't I, yeah great big beard lovely if you fancy your growing it, I'm all for it say to you wow that's great or do they say do you know what why don't you shave it takes you two minutes I kind of some Sometimes feel you see. I you suspect you're interview. making a connection, Lizzie, as well with hygiene. With hygiene, yes, because but a if deodorant... you don't do it, I mean, you don't think it's unhygienic. Presumably, you don't shave yours, Eamon. You no. don't think, oh my goodness, this is <laughs> wholly unhygienic. So, if it's not unhygienic on you, and let's be honest, men in general sweat more than women do, so it cannot possibly be unhygienic surely, on me we if have it's the not. The deodorant advantage on men because putting a deodorant on it, we get close to the skin, and also you get those horrible gloopy, gloopy gluey things mm -hmm. in the so, hair from deodorant, which is very unattractive. How often? Do you shave, Lizzie? Um, I'm not a very hairy person, mm. luckily for me, but um, I, would, I, I just make sure I do a lot of red carpet events, as you know, and I make sure I carry actually a razor in my bag. But all the Stop time? It. I carry, and in my in case gloves anything and sprites. But I don't want any hair. <laughs> the last thing I, I was on the red carpet recently with a very well known person, and she, she said, Oh my goodness, I've forgotten to shave my armpits. Luckily, I had whipped a razor. I whipped out my razor. Yeah. And, Running around the red carpet. And, 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 and another dear friend of mine got absolutely hammered in the press for having hairy armpits but look julia roberts did it in notting hill and what people we, felt the Lizzie, same way Lizzie, as me what should we be telling young girls we talk a lot about body image mm. we talk a lot about how girls you know are, are obsessed with how they look and we should tell them be confident it's about you as a person it's about yeah. brains not beauty it's about mm. you know <laughs> being who you want to be we are socially conditioned women to shave it's, we're just told as yes. we're growing up and you see your mother's doing it yeah, and their mother's doing it know, but 
I you wish feel like not to. But actually. Ruth, look, everyone, if you want to have hairy armpits, great. But I think everyone is entitled to do what they want. But also to look after yourself. I don't think it's going to help you walk into a, say, a job interview and you've got big hairy armpits, a big old bush hanging out. They're going to look at it. From and they your have, arm. From your arm, yes. yes. I mean, you might and be quite They're right. going to look and say, oh, you're going to, you're, you're sort of first impressions immediately are, does she look after herself? Are you saying is it's she lazy? Lazy. Then? And I do think it is un unhygienic. It's a grooming issue. It's a grooming issue. But this issue. is exactly it, isn't it? The idea that women, that women's natural bodies start off wrong and mm. bad, and you, and if you, you know, you have to make an effort to render your normal human body acceptable to the wider world. I mean, that's an attitude that needs challenging. Now, I'm not saying. Where do you think it started from? Where do you think? Yeah. Where, where the we influence? You said this has to happen. Do, do well, exactly. Know? I mean, as a, as a teenager, you know, I was just given a razor, and, and you know, my mum, my mum did, and everybody I knew did, and it was mm. just normal, and it was, and it, and then about five years ago, I was doing a show, um, one of my own stand-up comedy shows, and I and I talked about um, body hair in it, and then it just occurred to me, wouldn't it be funny if after I said that, I just scratched my head, and I thought, oh, there'd be a lovely little extra joke, so I grew it out, and um, and it, it feels really nice, and I, I yeah, and I realised that it was a lot of fun. Have you got a partner? And, Do you have a and, partner? Uh, yeah, I have several partners actually, yeah. and, 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 and I have no idea been... what their opinion is because they like me for my intelligence and yeah. my warmth and my and you generosity. Don't care what they think. And and to be honest with you, I think having I think having hairy armpits is wonderful in one respect, in that it wards off the sort of men who think that sort of thing is important.